quick update. So while finding my dock tags, I left my bag with the security here at the lounge. And because I was gone for more than 30 minutes, the other security took it and took it somewhere. So yeah, so I have, you know, I have like five hours, four and a half more hours till my flight is boarding. So I'm gonna eat and then go back and get the uh, bag. So yeah, that's what's happening. So here it is, I got it, got it back, got my uh, beat from Tahiti, paradise. I got my spiritual dog tag, St. Michael right here. I got my Marine Corps USMC tag. This is very important, I had it for 10 years, so I got it back here at Doha Airport. Guys, all the workers are the best, so professional. Thank you, Lahiru, <laughs> the cameraman. Thank you, sir. Okay, See you no next problem. time. All right, guys, I just arrived into the United States. Got my global uh, entry, which is a shortcut. See that? Because look at the line. Look at the line. So um, this is good. Global entry is a shortcut, which is good. Got my global entry car right here. It's nice. So not too bad. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> How's it? <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Watch out! How's it, Hangus? Welcome to Mongoose Max Hawaii, the channel. The channel. Okay. I was hoping this would come off without uh, technical difficulties. It's September 29th. It's Sunday, and I'm bumping my wires, so I gotta be careful about this over here. Oh! Uh, and uh, a little old and new. Try and try keep it simple. Uh, vlogging news. Oh wow! Old friend, um, Quentin, and uh, gave me a call, and another old friend. These are friends from high school. That's what I mean by old friend. The high school friends. <laughs> so one's coming in, and the other one's gonna give like kind of barbecue. You know, like this kind of thing. So, or kind of fight. It's like it's a little reunion-ish, and it happens every time around the reunion. <laughs> like a little mini reunion in the thing. It's it's wild. Everyone else is just like massively successful. I'm just like, <laughs> look at you, guys. Not thanks, all of us. Thanks for watching. Not all of us. So, anyways, uh, yeah, that's later today. Um, Michael from is back from the adventure in uh, election time in in uh, Nigeria, Africa, and it's just a rousing wow about, you know, corrupt election. He is also hooked up with uh, a person named By Baron, like Byron with a Baron or Bayron? Maybe it's Bayron. I B A Y. Anyways, that guy's pretty successful in this cryptocurrency thing, which is going to be the new rage for a little while. So I'll cover that in Crypto Corner. But old and new. I don't know about news for whatever. They're still doing the campaign. I think Trump called Hillary mentally cuckoo or something. Or <laughs> straight off just she's deranged. Is she? <laughs> just. This is my place. It's uh, gonna get just odd and kooky because it's getting down to the wire and they're battling for the swing states, so it's even gonna be. But just uh, hold on to the reality stuff. <laughs> so, so it show, everyone's, everyone's loving the show. Anyways, so. Old and new? Yes. Oh, yeah. We just have to do the prepare. And I want this dear Padre for the Inia Spiritus Sancti. Venus Sancta Spiritus, Venus Sancta Spiritus, Venus Sancta Spiritus. Old. Random, right? 
No comment. Proverbs. Oh, how many of these we get to go? Ah, Proverbs. Um, three, uh, two. Here's twenty-one. Uh, the true security, my child. Do not let these escape your sight. Keep them sound, wisdom and prudence, and they will be life for your soul and adornment for your neck. Then you will walk on your way securely, and your foot will not stumble. If you sit down, you will not be afraid. When you lie down, your sleep will be sweet. Okay, thank you. Proverb. There you go. Uh, Worth rubric, New Testament. Move it. I gotta be at red letters. Red letters? I think there is. Yes, there's red letters. This is... Oh. Later. John. Uh, 21. Uh, let's, let's skip the four where there's red letters. 21-4. Just after Bray Day... <laughs> Just after daybreak... Revolting. Jesus stood on a beach, but the disciples did not know that it was Jesus. Jesus said to them, Children, you have no fish, have you? They answered him, No. He said to them, <laughs> He said to them, Cast the net to the right side of the boat, and you will find some. So they cast it out, and now they were able to haul it in. They were not able to haul it in because there were so many fish that disciples who loved Jesus said to Peter, It is the Lord. Then, when Simon Peter heard that it was the Lord, he put on some clothes, for he was naked, and jumped into the sea. But the other disciples came on in the boat, dragging a net full of fish, for they had been not far from the land, only about a hundred yards off. Thank you, <laughs> Jesus. Okay, okay. Anyways. Uh, oh, okay. So that's that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, do something on Sunday spiritual. Mm. I, <clears throat> All right, folks, how you doing? I uh, have a message for you. It's for me in my life. I encompass body, mind, and spirit, the vision to succeed and lead. But it starts with personal preservation, uh, personal care. So you can follow my journey. I'll be posting on what's up when I can. Ask me fitness questions. Ask me blockchain or do what questions. Or just ask me uh, questions about lifestyle and nutrition as a well. whole. I'll see you. Thank, thank, thank. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, so um, let's go look at Hawaii news because there is some Hawaii news. I know it. Hawaii news. Please come back. Okay, come back. Hawaii news. Tax credits rolling. Um, like action. We're rolling, rolling on. Uh, so the film industry, television film industry, oh, is getting tax boy. credits. I guess they're rolling because the. Listen. Financial support estimated at $21 million, so they support the state supports by $21 million, the film industry. That's why they're just jazzed up to make any type of show. They're like, oh, remember Lost? And then the Red Now the latest one out, though, is um, res Big Surf Rescue. Big Surf. <laughs> there it is. Big Surf Rescue. Rescue Big Surf. And it's all about the lifeguard scene, and it came out about today. It comes out, right? I think Michael got a spot in this. I mean, you know, like background. He, he get lines when you get lines. He's talk lines, and ooh, yeah, residual. So here we go. And we're having a only for you Waikiki Center going to be redeveloped. It was the uh, Mary, or not a Mary Monarch, but the uh, floral. Uh, uh, okay. Oh. So here we go. Spreading Aloha. 
Moi Kane, which is king, Edward Kupua Kapau Kunipu, second from right, this guy, here's the king, Moi Kane, and the royal court float at the Royal Aloha Festival's 78th annual floor parade down Kalakaua Avenue on Saturday. So down Waikiki. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so he was accompanied by Moi Vahine, which is the queen, uh, uh, here, yes. Laura Mele, Kamali'i Kane, Kamali'i Kane, Prince, uh, Fool, she won't leave. That guy? <laughs> 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 and Kamala Princess, that's her, I guess. Fe Pua Le Hua O Kai Po Le Manu Nu Nu. Uh, at right, Hawaiian <laughs> at right, Hawaiian Airlines team Kakua. <laughs> and we're Kakua. You don't have to say the long names. Thank you. Hey, um, mm hmm Okay. The longest name wins. I don't know. And in sports, um, more volleyball. More football. What's what's going on? I wish I knew. <laughs> football. That's what's going on. Uh, and and this, which is building basketball, <laughs> it's for the future. <laughs> oh man, you know, it just just relax. You gotta keep. Okay, just a just a wee bit of relax. I remember when you want to relax back in 1982? Just go to the governor's desk and uh, go look. I got a little pin that holds my diaper on. See, put your face in that, governor. Governor George Ariyoshi watches Kathy Cambra carefully straps her 22-month-old son Christopher into a safety straight rig. <laughs> so this is what keeps you in your seat. <laughs> Strap them in. Okay. Iceland, bring your knitting needles to <laughs> knit your own sweater. <laughs> uh oh, no more domestic violence because domestic violence is bad. Oh, look, the political cartoon. My latest offering, the Trump watch. <laughs> That goes backwards in time? I guess so, huh? Maybe it's a countdown. That's what it is. Countdown. Oh no. Oh, the horror. Oh, what should we do here? Come here. Come here? Okay. Football conference. Explaining Trump's inexplicable support. Regarding a recent letter on support for Trump. Why well, support Trump after all he's done? Cite article September 20th. Let me attempt a reply. First, Trump supporters limit their sources of information to Fox News and similar right-wing media. Second, they don't fact-check dubious information, especially from Trump himself. Third, <clears throat> The media fails to hold Trump to the truth and moral standards expected of politicians excuse Unquestionably. Unquestionably. Thank you, ghost too. And they adore regardless the and they uh, 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 and they uh, 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 excusing and allowing his behavior as Trump being Trump. Fourth. Trump supporters cannot acknowledge they have been hoodwinked and deceived by someone they adore regardless of the obvious inconsistency that <laughs> happened there. <laughs> Funny. Funny, was it? What the heck happened there? It's a known. I'm scared. I live here. Hmm. Regardless of the obvious inconsistencies and fallacies of his statements and views. Fifth, some evangelical Christians truly believe Trump is a messenger of God and must ignore his bigotry, immorality, and deceit. There are, to be sure, many other reasons for to explain this phenomenon afflicting 40 plus percent, a plus, 40 percent plus of our mm, friends, neighbors, and family. But don't get mad. Be patient. Inform them without harassment, and hopefully, we will rediscover our similarities again. Francis M. Nakamoto, 
Moana Lua Valley. Well, gee, thank you there, friends. Instead, it was sorry for technical difficulty. It just wipes out if I just scroll. Boop. <clears throat> um. Yeah. So I don't know. It's getting closer to the you know just. Uh, the Constitution uh, provides a guaranteed secret ballot, which means you don't have to tell anybody who you're going to vote for, you know, and they're not supposed to advertise or campaign close to voting booths, so they're not they're supposed to har harass you either. And uh, I'm just, you know, it's the, the best policy to just keep mum and vote wisely. <laughs> That's the whole thing. Because I really do think there's like a, it's a, it's beyond political party because it used to be Republicans had a certain Republican thing that people would vote for that Republican thing, and they're fishing for that, but it's not there. <laughs> it's just it's usually going to get Trump if you vote for Trump. <laughs> oh. Anyways, oh, and those the like gathering social gatherings. I just I just steer clear. Don't talk about politics. <laughs> Some people won't talk to me because I said something about it. I said, like, oh, how could you talk to him? I said something bad about Trump. And then, like, In another place. In another place. Anyways, have a wonderful Sunday. That's all there is. That's all there is. Have a great Sunday. Aloha. Aloha to you. Aloha. Oh, look, it's going to be nice. Oh, gosh, what happened? People. Oh, aloha. Have a good day.